Previously on Zakia Loves Pinto. Therapy. PCOS sucks. And I took a very long lunch. <laughs> no faith in me. She did not. Baby don't think I could do it. We're having friends over tonight. Oh, the best okay. gift wins. You guys mind if I can cut? I'm in a rush. It's See? the skin for me. So we just got to my Auntie Pat house and um, we're we're about to celebrate and eat some good food, laugh and have fun and open up some presents. This is gonna be a great time. Yeah. I'm excited. Yeah. Um, this is my first time spending the Christmas holidays at Auntie Pat's house, so I know it's about to be lit. Need the, um, the plug, then the plug right here. No plug in. Looking up the TV for my auntie. Call me the handy. Handy woman. I am really handy. I mean, I probably get it from my mom. She is, uh, she actually always wanted to be a construction worker. I probably said that before, but I can be handy for sure. The youngest one in the family is the one that gotta um, come over for every tech setup. And then I'm gonna have to teach a one on one class on how to use the Roku TV. You know what? Because I'm the only sibling that's left here in LA, my parents, they call me for anything technical or, you know, that they just don't understand and they need help with. I am used to it at this point. It would be nice if my brothers was out here and I'll have some help, but you know, it is what it is. They did it for me. Now it's my turn. What? The mastermind. Whatsoever do you mean? Call me to handle one man. The clean old woman. Auntie Pat, she got a pound cake, baby. Pound cake. <laughs> what are you doing? Hey, D. Hmm? What happened? Moms, what happened? It's happened already. What happened already? The same thing happened already. Mm -hmm. Me and my mom, you know, we play back and forth. She is goofy. So, you know, I was really asking her, like, what's going on? And she said, it happened already. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> what is she? Oh, oh, is that that? Is that what it is? I thought that's what it was, but it didn't work. Shake me up. What you gotta do? Look at her just relaxed. Get in the yeah. kitchen. Now, mommy knows she's supposed to be up cooking. She's supposed to be in the kitchen. She the Jamaican queen. She's supposed to cook all our meals. I think kids are supposed to cook for their parents. It just is like a transition. Me and my sister, all holidays, basically, we cook. My mom may cook one dish. It just is what it is. As you get older, they stop cooking, you start cooking, and they start relaxing and sitting back and waiting for them to be pampered, for them hands to the feet. Probably legs ready. Ready already. You don't get no better than that. You don't get no better than that. Look at that. Look at that. I ain't gonna lie, I grew up kind of spoiled. My mom, she cooked for us. I mean, breakfast, lunch, dinner. We really didn't have to cook. So I'm a late bloomer when it comes to cooking. I didn't start cooking till like my mid 20s, really. You know, I know how to cook like basic stuff, but when it comes to Jamaican food, I still gotta up my game on that. Like I know how to make some curry chicken, even though I don't eat chicken anymore. I know how to make like, you know, the curry dishes. I can make some jerk dishes, just a few. I I have so much more that I want to know how to learn how to cook so let me get back to you on that you know I might have to do a little cooking show you know cooking with Pinto mm -hmm. Curry, you. Jimmy, I can't shrimp. D call it swim he don't eat swim look at that that's love right there wow look at that Listen in. I'm done hey mommy I love you Merry Christmas. Oh. Um, tell me how you were turning up last night. I was drunk last night. My mom is not really a drinker. Actually, like, she never drank. Maybe the last maybe two years, she got introduced to margarita. She like, ooh, a little strawberry margarita. So, you know, when she having whiskey, yeah. 10 times stronger than a margarita. Toasted. And she drinking it like water? Mom, come on. I'm gonna have whiskey for the first time. First like, time in my life, I didn't drink. That's crazy. Yeah, no, whiskey is like, that's why when you see the guys, they have like this much. And I was drinking it like I was drinking water. No, you was not. Yeah. No, I was no. drinking it really fast. Why would you drink it that fast? I don't know. Merry Christmas. What's up, man? Why you look like Santa Claus? <laughs> <laughs> I know. But I have the Christmas letter, but it's cute. Oh, no. You buy those in London? I did. I love them. 
Grandma, I'm not coming to my grandma for fashion advice. He went to Mary. <laughs> Cameron was right. Okay, we're not taking advice from these people. Literally, when I walked in the door and I had on an orange outfit, they started pinching my uh my stomach. And they were smacking my butt, like <laughs> staring like I got on some foreign alien costume. We ain't taking advice from these people in 2023. Mommy, Auntie Pat, y'all gotta get with the program. I'm gonna have to get y'all a little body outfit too, okay? This all smells so good, wow. And it always works out because like my mom's side, we do a big Christmas breakfast. Oh, really? Yeah, so then around three, four, I come over here and then we have a big Christmas dinner. Then you dinner. get the ballet. <laughs> then yeah. you get the Jamaican food. So I'm done. So wait, well, what's a big breakfast? What all y'all um, eat? We had waffles and biscuits. Oh, gosh, so oh, that's, yeah, that's beautiful. Oh, that's too much weird. I made this pie from scratch, okay? This pie was made with love from my heart. I love holiday food. I wish I could eat holiday food all year long and not gain weight. But literally, I have a slice of pie and it's straight here, straight here, straight here, straight here. I can't do it. Is this the same thing? That smells good. She ain't never gonna burn it. She used candles as souvenirs. Look, in the Jamaican culture, we definitely, when we get a gift, we gonna use it. Just certain things though, they just gonna use it as a souvenir. Like it is too, too, too nice. When they come out of the house and see me, I burn it, then they always say, um, I gotta see it to believe it. Okay. Growing up, I always wanted to burn candles that we had in the house, but my parents, they're like, don't burn the candle because it's going to burn down the house. I'm like, where did you get this from? Like, I understand when we're leaving, you know, blow it out. But no, they like, no, 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 don't burn it. I'm like, well, how can we enjoy it? Enjoy it. Smell it. What? <sighs> Remind me to not buy my mama no candles because I don't think she's going to use them. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Mommy, stop doing that. I hate it. I gotta look for cameras. Mommy. You gotta burn it, Mommy, when you go take a bath. I am going to burn it. Thank you. I am going to burn it in my bath. Burn it. Burn it up here. Gracias. Gracias. No, this is for me. Tell us to say the pan hot. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Mahali. <laughs> things, things is hot. <laughs> it's here. You're welcome. Thank huh? you. I'm not done Thank yet. You. Wait, good. Sit back down. Well, I, I'll take the hood because I look like a I was like, no, but no, I want oh, it. <laughs> I love mommy. I ain't never rejected no hugs. <laughs> <laughs> I love y'all. <laughs> but my Jamaican is so horrible. It's always something I have to do. <laughs> so I can see myself getting a popping. Unless she wanted to become a man. Right over there on Fifth Ave. You sound real Chinese too, then. Like, why is there so much grease here on your lips? That's all I got. This nigga is snatched. 